Welcome to Thursday's vocabulary lesson. Today's word is tantalising. Our quote from Tiger Tiger is nothing between him and that tantalising bouquet of aromas. So this this quote is referring to uh, it, when when Boots is in the wine cellar and the door is opened by the humans and Boots realises that there's nothing to stop him escaping the palace and entering the natural world that exists outside the palace. It says nothing between him and that tantalising bouquet of aromas. So a bouquet of aromas is a really, really pleasant smell and that pleasant smell is described as tantalising. Say it like me, tantalising. Say it quickly, tantalising. Say it like the Queen, tantalising. Say it low pitched, tantalising. Say it ecstatically, tantalising. So what does the word tantalising mean? Well, when something that you want very, very much is close, so close, but just out of your reach, it is tantalising. So in our quote from Tiger Tiger, what Boots wants is tantalisingly close. He wants his freedom. He wants to be back out, um, outside of the palace, in the natural world where he would be more at home, in the wild. So being out in the wild is something that he wants very, very much. He desires it very, very much. And it's very, very close. And at the time in the extract, it happens to be just out of his reach. Although, as we see when we get to the end of that extract, we see that he actually makes a bid, makes an attempt for his freedom. So it starts off being tantalisingly close, uh, but at the end, he actually receives it. Here are some other examples of the word being used. Now, you'll see what I've done is that I've added the ly suffix to the end of the word tantalising. Um, I think I've done that because that's a very common way of using the word. Rather than saying tantalising, we often use the word tantalisingly to describe something which is tantalising. I'll read these examples out and hopefully it will make sense. After reaching the final, the football team were tantalisingly close to winning the trophy. Or, with just three days to go, her birthday was getting tantalisingly near. So. It's a use. It's sort of a word to describe just how close, or just how near, you are to something that you really, really desire very, very much. It's tantalisingly close, or you're tantalisingly near. Now it's time for you to talk with someone at home. Think of an occasion when you have found something tantalising, something that has been very, very close but perhaps still felt very, very far away, or there's been a doubt whether or not you would get it, even though it was very close. Have a think and have a discussion. Now it's your turn to invent a sentence. Try using the word tantalisingly in that sentence. If you're stuck, you may use the following stem sentence to help you. After a long journey, the children were tantalisingly, 